I just got all our luggage, as you can see. It's somewhere between here and Calgary, because we had it in Calgary. Okay, here's the deal. At 87, a dream was set into motion. For years, they've been in millions of your living rooms. No couple has traveled the globe to bring you the adventures they do. Sport? Nah, it's a way of life. North America's favorite hunting couple are the real deal. They live at full draw. Close Encounters is what they do. It's not about glory, hype, or fame. It's about bows and arrows, baby. Draw, anchor, aim, release. Bucks, bears, bulls, birds, tree stands, ground blocks. Spot and stock. Now that's what we're talking about. Real hunting, real people, real adventure. We are the Archer's Choice. How far? 15.4 yards. Welcome to the Archer's Choice. Welcome to the Archer's Choice. This week we're going to head up to Alberta. Yes, ma'am. With Northern Adventure Hunts. Heather Cheney. That's right. And Joe and Z. They're going up there to hunt some spring black bears. They're in the ground blinds, they're in the tree stands, they're all over the place. Yeah, it's really cool. And they use their stealth cams a whole bunch on this trip to see you know, what bears are coming in and when. And that's a great tip because those stealth cams are going to tell you what baits are active and when. Is this, you pattern them and you make it Is happen. this the tip of the week time right now? No, sorry. No, I didn't think so. The Lucky logo's a mare step, so let's Ooh. just get into the first hunt. Joe's hunting out of a choice blind. We are in a mare step ground blind. Yeah, no, but so is Joe. The Just roll the footage. Hmm, the Guess who designed the choice? Quiet, 15.4 yards. 15.4.
yards. It's kind of close, Ralph. Yeah, that's how Joe probably got him. Because he had to be so close? Yeah. Oh, no. When I... we come back, we'll see if he can actually go and recover this bear. He's gonna, but let's, let's get see closer. closer. Okay. Zendel's shooting next. Ah! Welcome back to the Archer's Choice. Nice shot. Well, you know what? I even think that those two guys could find this bear. Yeah, it really wasn't that far of a re recovery to go no. find him. No. If that bear had a hunter safety system on, they probably would have had to climb up and get him. Hellraisers, baby. Right here, man. Look, he's right there. Look at that. Oh, man. Oh, man. Look at that. Look at that head on him, dude. That's not a bad head. I don't think he's a... He's not a bad bear, buddy. Look at those pads. It's not bad. I'll tell you what. We let this bear stand there and stand there and stand there. We weren't 100% sure it was a boar. We were pretty sure it was a boar. We knew he wasn't a real old boar. But I'll tell you what. He's a pretty good bear. Put a good shot on him. Does he turn around and show him where the barrel is? Right there. You tell me archery don't put him down quick, man. And Z's got to kill one now. That's a Freddy movie. Time for this week's Bow Hunting World Magazine Tip of the Week. Okay, it's real simple. This week's tip is probably one that we've been asked everywhere and we still tell everyone the same thing. You're right. Hey, do those thermocells really work? Oh my gosh. Try it. And when you don't think they are, turn it off, and in 10 minutes you're going to be swatting yeah. mosquitoes, what? black flies, no seams like Absolutely. you've never well, had before. Whether you're hunting black bear, spring turkeys, early season, early white, season tails. white tails, anything, and it's not just during the hunt; it's after the hunt. It's after you're going out, you're field dressing, you're taking photos. Whenever the bugs are irritating you, thermosel so is going to make simple. it work. On. Look for a little, little red light. light. There you go, and it's working. You know, I wonder if. They make a thermal wife. Ooh. Ooh. Hey, now we're gonna join Z. It's his turn up yep. there. You know, and they, they call this guy the bucket stealer, and the reason they being- They call Zendel the bucket stealer? No, not Z. Wow, I thought the he liked bear. donuts. He probably does. Yeah, but they, they spotted him. They figured out who was stealing the buckets by using their prowler or their stealth right? camp. Yeah. I'm telling so you. what do you think? Put your cameras up, get those photos, and they'll tell you what's going on at the bear bait. Okay, we need Bear it. down. Grab your turn. Arrows. No, you you go. No, I think you should. It's your, it's turn. your turn. Go. Get it. Day four. Bears two. Hunters one. This bait spike's been hit the last three evenings. We, we tried to find a place this morning to set our ground blind, our ground blind, our choice blind. But the wind's wrong and it's too open. So we're going to sit in an old platform, homemade platform stand. That's got the wind in the right direction, and we should be just perfect for about a 20 yard shot. That's our plan anyway. So stealth cam pictures have been coming in at 7 like 7.10. Last night he spent two hours here. So we should have plenty of time to get a good shot.
he's got the bear that's stealing the barrels. Don't go anywhere, because when we get back, we're going to see if Z could get the bucket bandit. The bucket bandit bait stealer? I couldn't say that. Yeah, don't go anywhere. But can you please go get the arrows? I'm going to fly down there. Fly down there. <coughs> wow. That wear you out? No, not at all. I'm amazed. Don't go anywhere. I use my speed hunter veins to get up there and move fast, quietly, stealthy. Welcome back. Hey, now we're you gonna forgot two of your arrows. These are the long ones, huh? Now let's just go see if we can Z can Easy with the arrows. Man. Let's, let's go see you... if Z could see the bait bucket stealer. Thief. Thief. B bucket. Thief. Thiefer. Thief bucket stealer. The, 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 the bear that's stealing the buckets. Okay, let's go see. <laughs> I think we just shot the bucket thief. <laughs> My arrow didn't even pass through, did it? Right there's the bear. <laughs> there you go, buddy. He's out. We actually had this bear on stealth cam pictures yesterday. He would, uh, come to the bait pile, steal the barrels, drag them here in the bush, and uh, eat his fill. And we, we saw his picture yesterday. We came in today, set up on the tree stand about 20 yards from the barrel, and uh, lo and behold, here he come. And he drug one barrel off, and when he went back for the second one, we ambushed him. Didn't go through him, hit the barrel instead, but uh, really beautiful bear. Woo that was cool. Smoked them. Hey, congratulations, down. Z. That was Z, awesome. Z, buddy, yes. Now, you don't want to go anywhere because when we come back, we're going to see if Joe can maybe get a second bear up there. Yep, yeah, because in Alberta, northern adventure hunts. You could take two bears each. How cool yeah, is that? What do you think Joe can get to is the question. Mm, I'm puzzled about that situation. Puzzled? Puzzled. Hmm. Oh, yeah. Notice. Welcome back to the Archer's Choice. Notice here, there. Mine, yours. Yeah, so, and your point. Really? Yes. Now, well, let's see if Joe. Why am I in the side with all the branches? Let's go see if Joe can get another bear. Look at this. So what? You should be on this side. Tough it up, girl. Let's go see Joe get his Tough second bear. Tough it up. Can't find anything to hit you with. We got about a mile ride in to our end bait site. We're gonna drag a beaver because that bear would probably come back in because every two or three days it's been coming in. Bait hadn't been hit a few days, so we, we're gonna drag this beaver. That way if he cuts the trail, maybe we'll get another bear or that bear to come in still.
is awesome. Look at the feet. Oh man. I cannot tell you. We've had a we've had a hard on. I'm not gonna lie to you. We came the first part of spring. The bear zendel shot yesterday. Still had the hair on the pads. He's been out of the den maybe a week. The first bear I shot was a 6'4 bear with an 18-inch skull. This one's a lot bigger. Wow, what a great week for the guys, huh? It was. Joe, Z, congratulations. That was great. They were up there with Northern Adventure Hunts. Yep, Heather Cheney. And thank you, Heather, I mean, for making their, their bear hunting dreams come true. And we need to thank Travel Alberta. Absolutely. Absolutely. And? Okay, cool. And, oh, if you happen to see the Lucky logo this week, it was a Maristep. Stimulus package. It was a Maristep. Click on, go on to archerschoice.com. Click on the Lucky logo button. Click, click. Fill out some information. Someone's going to win some great stuff from a Maristep. So? So we want to thank you for watching this week's show. We'll see you next week, same time. Same channel. Right here. On the Archer's, Archer's Choice. Choice.